In this video, we solve problem 6.1.16-T from Essentials of Statistics, sixth edition by Mario Triola. So we're asked to find this z-score and we're told that the area to the right is 0 0.1711. Now, if we look at our table, our table of z-scores, both positive and negative z-scores, you're never going to find areas to the right. You're only going to find areas to the left. So if I want to find this z-score, I need to find this area to the left first. Now, we know that since this is a probability distribution, the area under the curve has to be one. So the area to the um, left, which is what I want so that I can find that z, is just one minus the area to the right. So that's just one minus this 0 0.7 or 0 0.1711. Use the calculator for the arithmetic. And we get 0 0.8289 as the area to the left. Now we're not done yet. We need to find this area of 0 0.8289 in our table. Now, since that area to the left is greater than 0.5, we know that this is a positive z-score. So I'm going, going to go to my table and I'll look for positive z-scores. Here I am. Now, this time we're given the area and we want the z-score. So you don't wanna look around the outside of this table. That's what we almost always do. If we're, we're given a z-score and we want the area, this time we're given an area and we want the z. So we know that that area over there must be 0 0.8289. So I'm looking for 8289. 8289 is right there. That corresponds to z equals 0.95. So that's 0.95. And that's it. Easy breezy. That's our answer.